Well, didn't he say anything to you? Oh, yes. Well, what? Oh. Morning. <laughs> yeah, but it was that morning. Oh, morning. <laughs> well, Miss Trimmer was going full pelt, so I had to lip read. So he, he didn't say nothing like tell Linda I love her? Oh, if he did, he ventriloquised it. <laughs> Is he a ventriloquist? Well, I wouldn't mind him sticking his hand up his skirt and making me lips move, do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, it's <laughs> tragic, Beryl. And all we've got to show for it is one lousy letter he left. But why didn't you say? I could phone my great pal, Rini. When she came off the game, she took up handwriting analysis. Oh, hang on, I'll get it. Uh, but won't you actually have to <laughs> see the handwriting? No. She knew my niece Janet in Joburg was a lesbian just by me describing the apostrophes in her suicide note. <laughs> Oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> Rini? Gag the chinchilla. I want a consultation. <laughs> OK. Have you got a copy of this week's Bella handy? Right, OK. Page three. The first letter be an H and it's twice the size of Anthea Turner's head. <laughs> what? Oh, all right, I'll read it. It says, Hi, cats. Thanks for last night. PTO. <laughs> I'll be back at lunchtime tomorrow. See you then. Jez. <laughs> no, it's Peter. Jez? Peter. P PTO. It's P-T-O! P-T-O! But he ain't put a dot in between each letter! Oh. Mummy always said you had to put a dot in between each letter! Oh, you bloody stupid woman! <laughs> bloody well kill you! Well, it ain't my fault I can't help being visibly disabled. <laughs> anyway, P-T-O's coming back to me. Do you want this consultation or don't you? I've got to get my beauty sleep. Century of sleep wouldn't be enough. <laughs> Where's my bed? You put my bed back, you! Try the bedroom, love. Oh. <laughs> you come here. Oh. You oh. get out of my bloody wet. <laughs> <laughs> no, Reen. Keep talking. It's their bill. 